All right, welcome back on our hazy, smoky Monday afternoon. I'm getting used to this haze, right? Don't necessarily like it, but it has been there for a while. Looks like at least next couple three days. We'll continue to see some of that smoke. First alert weather headlines, few storm chances uh, this evening right through your Wednesday. Low 90s settling in. Now again, many areas not hitting the 90s today. We're back in it for Tuesday through Friday. There are cooler temperatures on the way, much cooler. It's going to take a little time though, so let's just get used to the heat like we've seen recently over the next several days. You see that smoky sky out there very hazy. Our numbers out there, they're warm. They're not as hot as we saw on Friday on Saturday. 87 degrees right now. Fargo feels like 89 though, given that little bit of humidity we have in place. 84 degrees. Our temperature in Moorhead for Grand Forks 86. Nice sky out there getting a little bit of haze, but still looking good at that blue sky. Temperatures around the region were as cool as 80. Thief River Falls, 81 Bemidji, Baudet and Rosa. Those numbers are pretty comfortable. 82 Detroit Lake. Also, Jamestown. Again, it's right here up and down the Red River Valley, Grand Forks, Fargo, and then spreading south towards Sisseton and Fergus Falls, where we have our numbers in the mid 80s right now. Heat index making it feel a little warmer, but again, I think the biggest difference here at Fergus Falls up to 97 with the heat index, Sisseton 93. Again, a lot of low, mid, upper 80s otherwise. And that's factoring that temperature plus the humidity in place. Air quality, you saw it right there. Not great. It's at the moderate level. So, uh, luckily, we're not in a worse position than that. But again, we've seen a lot of yellow this last week, plus where the uh, air quality has just not been that great. Satellite radar. Notice some of the flashing up here. Severe thunderstorm warnings. That is not for our area, at least not yet. The hope is we don't see severe storms in our region, but those storms are to the west. They are heading our direction. Uh, the atmosphere does uh, promote conditions, which we could see some of those severe storms again later this evening. Uh, Bismarck in particular right now, severe thunderstorm warning. You see one off to the south and west as well as the north as well. So again, a pretty widespread area where we have some severe weather again. Off to our west, we're going to keep an eye on things, of course. Meanwhile, we take a look, area shaded in yellow here. Slight risk for severe storms in our area. This does include parts of the James River Valley. The dark green encompassing most of the rest of the region. That is at marginal risk for severe storms. So with that in mind, we kind of track things through the evening overnight hours. So watch about 11 p.m. through about 115, 130. What we're finding is a pretty good opportunity to at least see some thunderstorms. Grand Forks down through Fargo and areas east. Will they be severe? Again, we're going to keep an eye on that for you. What we do know is pretty good chance of at least seeing lightning, thunder, some gusty winds and hail as well. Severe weather impacts, tornado risk low. It's there, but it's pretty low. Large hail up to an inch, high winds, 60 plus miles per hour. That is the greatest risk, and that usually is the case with these storms. First alert forecast moving through the evening overnight hours for you. Again, you see that opportunity for showers and storms. It will push out by about 3, 4 o'clock in the morning, leaving us with actually a very nice Tuesday. It's going to be another warm day. In fact, hot for some, getting up to 93 degrees in Fargo. Then tomorrow evening, looking at the potential for maybe another round of severe weather. Check out our highs tomorrow, mid 80s to low 90s out there. 92 Grand Forks, 93 Fargo. Severe risk for tomorrow. Once again, areas out west have the best chance of seeing severe weather. 90 Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, 87, 88. Still a chance of storms here and there next week. Couple 85s and 81, 79, 78. So something to look forward to if you're tired of the heat. An actual mm -hmm. cool off, though it's a ways out. Yeah, yeah it's a ways <laughs> out, but it, it looks like a real <laughs> cool off, though. Yeah. <laughs>